It's qualifier number one. We're live from Humbantota. The Jaffna Kings taking on the Gaul Gladiators. The pitch played on a little bit earlier and both teams felt that they were 20 runs short. And 140 played 140, but it was certainly a 160 pitch. The toss was a little bit early as well, and the Jaffna Kings, they won the toss and decided that they were bowl first to Sara Pereira, the captain, feeling that uh, the wicket was a good one and then it was worth having a chase. Alongside me, Darren Gunga and Roshan Abasinga. Roshan, there's been one or two changes to the teams. Some obvious ones with uh, Tikshana and Vanidu Hasaranga coming back. Well, Anwar Ali gets his first game, Nuan Tushara is in. So, they're, they're certainly going to miss No Ramad, who's gone for these under-19 Asia Cup. So, that's going to be a big miss for the Gold Gladiators. But Jaffna Kings, they look, they look a really, really strong side. We're nearly ready to go for qualifier number one. The winner of this goes straight to the final. Watchful. Turner, this time there's no slip. And the ball's turning away from the left-hander and away for four. Oh, with a bit of that. <laughs> That's big. That's large. Good confidence. He's the leading run scorer alongside his captain in this uh, franchise. Down the ground, smeared down the ground. Oh, <laughs> how about that? How about that? Too much to do for deep square leg. Too much for do. Up and over mid off. And one bounce and four more. This is a rollicking start. Now pulled away. That is emphatic, that shot. Choose the aggressive side of him. Too short. Saranga Lakmal trying to make the accommodation after being punished. Back pass him and pays a heavy price. Consecutive boundaries. Gee, that's a good shot. That's a brilliant shot by Danish Gunitilaka. Pitch shot this time by Mahesh Tekshana. That's tossed up too much. And that's hit well by Kusal Mendes. He met it on the full. There's two men out on the leg side, long on and a deep mid wicket. And he just bisected them perfectly. There you go. There's another one. A good over. Cut away. Beats the man. That's going to be four more for Kusal Mendes. Hard slog sweep into the gap by Danushka Gunatilaka. He kept that down and hit it very, very hard. Cuts hard. That's a good shot. We've seen that before already from Kusal Mendes. That flew to the boundary. That's a six. And that's the 50 for Danushka Gunatilaka. He brings it up in fine style. The 100 partnership is up as well. It's 105 without loss in 11. That's the 50 for Kusal Mendes. Uh, they have complemented each other. 50 of 33, one delivery quicker than Danushka Gunatilaka's 50. But what a fine innings it's been. All good shots, thoroughly enjoyable. Danish Gunatilaka got to his 50 with a 6 over deep mid wicket of a slog sweep. Kusal made this little nudge. High, big. And it's a
yards out of here. In fact, over the line for six. Back across, deep in the crease, clears the left leg and swings away for the bleachers. Quick feet to get into position, just a, a push off that left foot. Jeez, that was poor from uh, my extinction. That was so short. Bold him. He's done it himself. Gave himself room. Hit it away on the offside. That ball didn't bounce. Pace off the ball as well. 13 overs gone, so you can understand what he's trying to do. Trying to up that rate. 55 wonderful runs from Gunatelaka. It's 121 for one. Glory of the nation. Glory of the nation. Where has that gone? Sailing, sailing over the boundary. All the time in the world, look at him, watch it. Watches it all the way on to the bat and off it. Angled at the body. That's a freebie. Just over the top from Anwar Ali. That's what they need him to do. If he's going to come in, he's got to go for it. That was a good shot. Oh, that's been top edge. There's going to be four more valuable runs. He nicks that one, though. Almost exactly the same delivery and shot, but this time the edge goes through to Gurbaz. Comfortable catch for him. Anwar Ali promoted as a pinch hitter. He's going after every and anything. Gurbaz completing a catch, another wicket for Tassara Pereira. And he goes to 12, 147 for two. Down the track, Mendes, classy. Up and over, cover. Plays that shot beautifully well. Massive six. Look at that for a stroke. Committed to the front foot. He knew if he was getting any bat, he's going over the top and wanted to go over the top and beat it so well. Clubbed through the gap. Short from Wahab Riaz and that length has not worked for him in this over. Oh, that's out. That is dead. That's the way to respond. Mendes is gone. Surang Lakmal nailing his Yorkers. This time, Kusal Mendes. Don't think he's going for a review. Looks very, very straight. And something that... Oh, he's gone for it. He's gone for it. Original edition is out. Pitching in line, impacting line. We cut City. Rabuksu can stay with the original edition of out. I believe. He has now. <laughs> well, we all knew that. Good innings. Kusal Menes, 85 or 53 balls, 175 to 3. Pulled high by Hafiz, it hasn't got the distance, it's a long boundary. Hasaranga gobbles it up. And straight away, Mohamed Hafiz, time to go over mid wicket. Easily caught at the boundary there by Wanindu Hasaranga. Hafiz came, Hafiz gone. Gladiators, 176 so cool. Whoa, that sounded good. Really good. That's big. In the slot. Bang, off the ground. Slower ball, which is also got hold of. That's really big too. This time over deep mid wicket. Perfect base, slower ball, this time by Wabriyas. Go on the distance. Van Rajapaksha on fire. Last ball of the innings is heaved away by Rajapaksa. Last well caught. Well caught by Chaturanga going round there. 188 for five. Could have been 194. 
Chaturanga getting around well, juggled it. I think he was thinking about flipping the ball up, but uh, in the end he didn't need to because he was just a yard inside the boundary. The Gore Gladiators have made their highest score of the tournament. What a time to do it. Rajapaksa, 25 or 15, has helped them get them there. So the equation for Jaffna, they need 189 to win the game and go straight through to the final from their 20 overs. Oh, he's picked that up, he's picked that up with the swing. What a start. My word, no respect for the senior fast bowler Mohammed Ahmed. Oh, got him, got him. The ball swings, swings from off stump and it cleans him up. Just a little bit of tail back into the right hand. And if you don't think it means anything to these overseas players who come to these leagues around the world, Mohamed Amir has just shown that it means a great deal. As Avishka Fernando departs for the solitary six, it's six for one. Runs, runs, tight on the pads. Golakadmo is on his way. Brilliant from Gurbaz. It's a six. He's been caught on some services that don't quite suit him. This one might. This one just might. No turn for Samit Patel. Down the ground. He's got all of that as well. Cleanly hit. Oh, he's chipped that. Has he taken it? Yes, he has. Yes, he has. That's the second wicket. First squared him up. Had him shutting the face of the bat. Got the edge of the bat and then an excellent take. Resulting in a second wicket. And that two of Tom Corner Patmore. Dangerous batsman. Walking back for four. It's 22 for two. Oh, Kurbas, wow, look at her go. That's massive. Huge from Gurbas. He sees it. He hits it. Oh, good hit again. Down the ground he goes. How about that? How about that? Yes, he's gone upstairs, but that was good work by Pulna Taranga. Uh, can you freeze it when the... Uh, yes, the best one is short of his ground. The wickets are broken. And I have a decision for the giant screen. My decision is had the presence of mind, just picked it up and backhanded it. And Ashin Bandara's struggle is over. Well, he has to walk back. It wasn't a pleasant stay for him. 9 of 17, 53 for 3. is swept and it will fall once and then bounce over the line for four. Oh, I'll tell you what, when he hits, they stay hit. They just stay hit. Sound of that bat. Gurbaz holding that pose for the photographers. Wow, yeah, 109 meters, that's massive. Again, punch through extra cover. That's four. Goodness, this man is a powerful striker. He gets to his 50. 
of just 27 balls. Oh, that's where they've been lucky. Picking up wickets at the right moment. Now he's found the middle of the bat. But straight in. That's a very good catch because it was hit hard and it was low. Well picked up. Joyd Malik goes. He's made just a 283 for four, the Kings. And straight away, Govars tries to go big, but hasn't got it. And he's going back to the pavilion. It was a slow delivery, not middling the ball. Well, Judge Cat. Yes, ran in a long way. Tanara Chigek. But great execution, keeping his plan simple. Gurbas, 59 runs, but not enough for the Jaffna Kings at the moment. 85 for five. Hasaranga tries to go up and over long on, and he does it. Time he goes across and he goes big again. That's much bigger than the previous six. The ease where Asaranga is hitting him out of the park. Now he goes back and cuts and he beats the man just behind square on the offside. What a finish to the over. That's gone. That's gone. That's another full toss that's been slapped straight to cover. This time it's Hafiz who takes the catch. We got the big fish. Oh, yes, big all right. Pereira could have taken the team home. But then the wideish full toss forcing him to hit to an area he's not usually comfortable with. Pereira four, and then nine for six. Oh, that's a nice up and over shot. Just a flick of the wrist from Hasaranga. Going for a six-up. Miscued. And into the safe hands of Isuru Dana. It's great bowling, taking away from the left-handed batsman. Chaturam trying to swat it over mid-wicket. Only managing to get the bottom part of the bat. And Shurudana doing the rest and rally. So thinking easy game. Shaturanga de Silva gone for six. Kings 121 for seven. High into the night sky. Someone will catch it. Yes. It's Anwar Ali yet again. Gunatilika was converging onto Anwar Ali and there was a point where the decision was, it's mine, it's my catch. And it nearly slipped through the bottom, but no one will remember that in the morning. He's bowled well tonight to Shara, he really has. It's a big one for him, Hasaranga goes for 29, 124 for 8. Make it another one, two in the over. Sarah on fire. Look at that, another slower delivery. Not coming up. Mentioned there's no dew, hence there's not ball, not going to skid on. Labrias in the penalty of playing too early. Gone for one. Kings, one, two, four for nine. Edge and gone. That's a five for for Tushara, well-deserved reaction from the coach. Omar Gold says it all. Mightn't be the Colosseum, but this Gladiators team from Gold, they've conquered. This is how the match ended. Five wickets joy for the gladiators.
always a very remarkable accomplishment for any bowler to get five wickets in any format. So summary of this uh, qualifier one, Gold Gladiators producing a mammoth 188 for five, thanks mainly to half centuries by Kusal Mendes and Gunatilika. The Kings, they started well, but they just couldn't sustain. The Gladiators winning by 64 runs. Hurry.